Hey guys, it's your boy Christian Plays here. Welcome back to Crying Sons. This is part three, I do believe now that we're doing this game. Um, well, there ain't really much to be said aside from grab your popcorn, grab your beer if you wanna, and let's dive in and enjoy ourselves. Continue game. Oh man, for a minute there, I thought <laughs> I thought I clicked the new new game button. All right. All right. So here we go. The star map button opens the current star sector star map where you can choose your next base destination system. Alright, let's uh, play a little peekaboo. Okay, each system contains different points of interest, POI, Ground signal indicators show a system with a planetary expedition. Trading beacon. I'm sorry guys, I'm, I'm really hungry. I made myself a, um, a sandwich, obviously. Trading beacons and beacon indicators show a system where you can buy or repair equipment on the board. Indicators show a system where you can improve the mark of your squadron. Okie dokie, indicators show obviously a system where there is a high level of risk and or reward. Coming alert. Each time you jump, the current sector rulers get more suspicious. Once the alert counter reaches zero, they will follow your tracks and try to find you. Being caught will result in a very difficult and unprofitable encounter. I can never. 
description displays the type of artifacts you will have a chance to collect during the expedition. Each type will always yield some kind of reward. This section displays the type of major threats expen exponentially dangerous situations your team will face during the expedition. Be careful about those. Ground distress signal displays the number of possible retreats your team will have during the expedition. Officer survival represents the chance your leading officer will return safely. Healthy officers have a chance to come back injured. Injured officers have a chance to die. An injured officer injured or dead officer will abort the mission, forcing your team to retreat ship to ship without loot. Okie dokie. Resource extraction meter represents the minimum and maximum percent of encountered resources. Artifacts included that your team will have a chance to bring back with them to your ship if the leading officer survives the expedition. Okay. The commando survival meter represents the chance of your commandos have the chances your commandos have to return safely. Displays minimum and maximum possible number of commandos that will not make it back to your ship. I'm gonna risk it. I'm gonna risk it. Planetary. I really hope I didn't make a mistake.
some officers, yeah. Advanced maneuver. Lethal firing. Heat sustained by system from battle ship weapons. Deal two DPS to enemies adjacent to your battle ship systems. Add one uh, absorb shield every 15 seconds to the first unshielded battleship system in this order. Whole squadron weapon. Okay. Ah, oh, screw it. I'll buy a ball. Got R and D for you, sir. Okie dokie. Sir, I hate to have a complaint, but we're dwindling, whittling our thumbs down here, looking for a bit of direction. Anything in particular you'd like us to work on? Yeah, develop a new weapon. But it's going to require a fair amount of scrap. We're good. But we're not that good. Still interested?
Well, guys, that's going to be it for this one. Although, I wish I could have gone back and uh, actually built that weapon. I should have done that. I'm probably going to regret it later on. Um, but, that being said, we're, I'm going to go ahead and end this. Thank you all so much for watching. If you're enjoying it as much as I do, uh, boy, hit that thumbs up button. Obliterate it and turn it to dust. And if you're new here, be... Nah, feel free to hit that subscribe button if you feel like it and turn on notifications if you do so you can stay tuned for videos and streams that I'll be doing in the future and by also feel free to share with your friends so they can come and enjoy it enjoy it as well that being said my name is Chris, my name is Chris Please 94 and I'll see you in the next one peace